In this video, we will show you how to register your boat on Wavy. Number one, boat details. In the following, you can see the profile for your boat, which you have to fill in completely in order to provide your customers all the important information. First, enter your boat details one by one as shown here. Please type in the name of your boat. The red asterisks indicate that this is a mandatory field. Then, you can choose between the options of boat types and simply click on them. Finally, please give details about the boat, like brand, model, etc. And choose if you want to hire a skipper, if the renter has to be one, or if there's none needed. In the What do you expect from the hirer column, you can enter which characteristics a hirer who wants to rent your boat has to meet, e.g. driving licenses, experience, etc. Click now to save everything on the next button. Number 2. Boat Description In your title, briefly describe which heading you want your boat display to have. This is visible for your customers. After that, all points in the description which make up the boat and describe it realistically should all be filled out. Remember that your description is like an advertising text, and it depends on the description whether a customer decides for your boat. At the end, you can add your desired languages with the help of our auto translation to reach more customers. For example, simply click on German or French, and then on the Get Translation button, and you're done. Click now to save everything on the next button. Number 3. Photos Now, insert pictures that show the boat from the outside as well as from the inside. Also, a room overview of the boat is helpful. Select the main picture which should be shown first in the overview and the search. Finally, name your pictures so that everyone knows what is shown on the picture. Click now to save everything on the next button. Number 4. Location Now we have come to the location of your boat. First, please select a suitable berth for your boat from the menu. Afterwards, type in the name of the berth, e.g. ACI Marina Split. Then enter the address of your berth. You can also enter the GPS coordinates in decimal format. In the next step, under Pickup and Return, enter your standard check-in, check-out times. Of course, you can coordinate these individually with your customer on site. At the end, you enter all necessary information under Pickup Information, which the tenant needs to receive the boat, e.g. where the keys will be handed over. Click now to save everything on the next button. Number 5. Price Under the category Price, you enter the standard amount for one rental day. Under the category Additional Fees, you enter additional fees, like the deposit and the cleaning fee. The deposit will be collected on the day of check-in and returned 48 hours after checkout. The cleaning fee is added once for each booking. Under the category Seasonal Prices, you can adjust the daily prices to your needs as, for example, in Seasons. To do so, simply click on Add Season. Give the season a name and select the start date and the end date as well as the price. It is also available to add periods when the boat is not available. For this, just click on Not Available. Of course, you can add as many different seasons as you like. If you do not create a season or there is no season for certain periods of time, the boat will automatically be available at your standard price set above. In the calendar below, you can get a quick overview of your availability configuration. Click now to save everything on the next button. Number 6. Publishing In the last step before the publication, we ask for your owner documents. Please pay attention to which kind of files you should upload. Please confirm to us that you have the right to rent this boat by clicking on all checkboxes, because you can only publish your boat if they are checked. In addition, we need the boat's title deed, the owner's power of attorney if the lesser is not the owner, and a scan of the boat's insurance. Click to upload on the fields or drag and drop them into the fields. Click now on Publish. Congratulations! Your boat is now online and the registration is finished. Of course, you can change your information at any time.